everybody and welcome back. Today I have cushion grip. I'm going to attempt to use this in my top denture. I don't have that in. I do have my bottom denture in though and it, it just feels weird without the top one in there. I also have denture fit here. I'm going to use this first because they say this only lasts about four days and then I'll do a video do it using all of this denture fit. I'll do a review on this and how to apply it. Hope I get it right. I also have the denture clean removes tough stain cleaner here. So we're going to be doing this in an upcoming video. So subscribe and um, come back. Hit the little bell thingy so you'll be notified of my video. But anyway, cushion grip. That's what we're doing now. And I've been reading this, all the instructions, and if you watch any of my cooking videos, I'm not really good at reading instructions, <laughs> but this we're doing. This is zinc free, by the way, and that, that kind of makes me happy because I think I'm having an allergic reaction or something to the zinc that is in the adhesive. I think that's bothering me. Hi everybody, before we start this video, I just want you to know that I, I do some check-ins after I put this in. So I added that. I changed my mind after I ended the video. I'm like, oh. This says on here, thermoplastic denture adhesive. So this is a thermoplastic. But when you read the instructions here, let's do that real quick. We're going to read them real quick so you know, just in case you've never done this, okay? The quantity needed to secure dentures varies. So I'm sure if you have a man size mouth, you're gonna need more women's size mouth, probably less. Do not use if you have open sores or cuts in your mouth. I don't have any of those. A temporary slight, slight top denture. If you don't have dentures yet and you're getting them, you're gonna to have to learn how to talk again. When I'm around without my dentures in the house, I found myself doing that. I just rest my tongue up on there and it doesn't look as bad. Rob doesn't have to look at old lady face. All right. A temporary slight stinging or burning sensation like mouthwash may be experienced at first application. I, I'm sure. I know when they did my reline in my denture, it's, it, I didn't enjoy that. I mean, it was okay. It just tasted gross and it stunk. So we're gonna see about this. Cushion grip is not a glue adhesive. It works similar to a temporary soft reline by filling in the gaps and spaces between your gums and dentures to secure the fit. If you experience an allergic reaction to this, it is, here we go, very, very, very. I can't say that either. It's easy to remove. All we have to do is soak your teeth in hot water and it will peel out. So if you have a problem with this, you can take it out. It doesn't, it's not a permanent thing. All right, moving you down. I have my denture here, and I have in Rob's coffee cup, this tube has to soak for five minutes, so we've got that. And what we're gonna do is, is put this in, in this groove. It also says put it across the back if you want to, but we can add that later. You can add more to this, so if you go thinner with it. And I might put across this back right here only because I'm finding that food is getting up underneath from the back. That's what I'm finding. So this has been in the water for five minutes. And after we get this put on here, it has to sit for five minutes. Oop. Okay. So I hope it doesn't smell. Yeah. It reminds me of something. Now what I've seen people do is take a whole bunch out and kind of roll it like play-doh and put it in there and then i've seen people just daub it in and put it in there so we're going to do the daubing it in and putting it in there that, that's that's our plan and they said to get it as far back as you possibly can okay it's sticky and then just plop it back <laughs> plop it back in the water okay all right this is like i don't know if you've ever made candy it's kind of like that but I know that I don't, I don't, like taffy, like the taffy feeling. I don't want to get way too much in there. But, but then again, you see, you could take it out. All right, I gotta turn it this way. To, you could take it out of here 
just by soaking it in hot water if you don't like the way it fits. And I think I'm gonna have to put just a little, wonder what, let me try putting it on my finger and see what happens. Oh, my finger's wet, okay. My dentures were clean and dry also. What, oh, oh, okay, see it's kind of stringy. They were clean and dry when I did this. And I imagine you have to get the same amount on both sides. That might be a thing. I didn't think about that. And I'm going really light with these. I know that I am because I probably could go heavier. I'm going to put this dog in the front. I'm pretty sure I could go heavier. Because I've got this in here. See how thin it is? That's it. And it... <sighs> It kind of smells, but not... Oh, I forgot to put it back in the water. Jeez. Because it has to stay pliable. And this reminds me of something. Something that either my brother did or Rob did or my dad. I don't know. It, it reminds me of something. I need a little more. Up. I have this linked below. I think it, it was only like 6 or $7. It wasn't a lot of money to... It wasn't a lot of money to buy this. Alright, we're gonna let that. I think that's good. I don't should I put I'm gonna do it. Why not? I can always take it off if I don't like it. We'll just do it real thin. I'll put it on the back here. I'm gonna put it right across here because I notice that I'm getting food in my up there. I don't want that up there. So I'm going to just put like a little there. We'll see. Or should I put, let me put it all the way across. See, I keep changing my mind. Oh, come on. And then it's supposed to sit for five minutes. We'll let it do that. Then you can put it in your mouth. And I've heard people say they leave it in for a couple hours and then if there's any excess, trim it off. But I don't think I'm going to have excess. I don't think so because I'm putting it in there really thin. Come on, come on. Get off my finger. Okay, there. There, I think I got it all. I know, I bite my fingernails. I know that. I'm 55 years old and I still bite my fingernails. All right, right now I'm going around and feeling, let's see, I want it smooth, but I'm feeling if it's thicker on one side. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. We're going we're gonna to figure it out together. All right, I can see the front. I imagine if you do this and use more at one time, uh, it might, I don't know. I don't think I'd do that. Just a little bit at a time, that's what we're doing. All right, there it is. This has to sit for five minutes, and then we'll come back, and I'll put this in my mouth for you. All right, I'll be back in. Dog. Five minutes. Those of you that watch my videos know the dog always barks. All right, it's been ten minutes, and it says... There's my dryer. And it says to start from the front, push it in the front back and then push it back. So that's what we're going to do. Is that a deal, Ed? It says to bite down, but not like like bubbles popping. All right, I think it's okay. I do think it's okay. And you get enough, you saw there's one ounce in here and look how much I have left. And it recommends that you do it like weekly, but it, then on the package it says it only lasts for four days, so. It's been about two hours and I don't need glue in my mouth right now. I, I don't need any of that because this is holding it quite well. I'm really quite happy with this. I might add a little more right in this area. That's where I kind of thought it was like, didn't have a lot there to begin with. But when you do this, don't pile it in there because you saw how much I put in there, just a little bit. 
that was enough unless your dentures are really loose but you can always add more and I liked the fact that I put it on the back on the back plate across the top that's holding it it's I'm, I'm I like this I'm a winner for the cushion grip and it's not expensive I may end up doing this to my bottom one we'll have to see I'm really worried about messing with my bottom one though because it's I can get it in there and it stays really good my top one was getting really loose so anyway this feels really good it does all right I have this one ounce and then the denture fit subscribe come back because we're gonna do the denture fit next oh a link for this I, I put a link in my description so anyway if you want that all right I will see you in my next video bye